The bud of this tree has the power of enlightening the light. This bud gives the light like a wick in the night time. The buds and the leaves of a tree found in the Biligiri Ranga forest area in Yeladur Taluk burn bright giving out the light when oil is applied to them. This is one of the rarest trees which is found in the parts of Biligiri Ranganabetta of Yelanduru Taluk. This tree is popularly known as Kaikarilu tree. This is one of the rarest trees to find in the villages and it is belonging to the species of teakwood tree. The leaves of the tree is different from other tree leaves. This tree leaves produces a substance like the oil and from that oil it burns like a wick there is a belief in the tribal people that pandavas are using this tree during the time so it is also called pandavas wick tree from the tribal people so pandavar abatti anta karitare when pandavas stay in hastinavati they use the wicks to light the lamp but when the wicks was finished during the time they use this for lightning so the tribal people were calling this tree as pandav tree According to a local legend the Pandavas of Mahabharat used these buds and leaves to light up their huts when they lived in the forest Hence the Soligas also call the tree the wick of Pandavas The Soligas believe that one of their ancestral women had taught the skill of lighting these buds and leaves to Draupadi the queen of Pandavas The people of Soliga make the roti and ragi mutte from the leaves of this tree during the festival of roti and ragi Soliga used to distribute the roti and ragi mutte from this tree leaves Matte ivara roti abba ragi abdalle ella ee elena elaninda The Kaikarilu tree's bud has the capacity of storing the oil and from the oil it can provide the light like a lamp. The people of Soliga gives the special preference to this leaves and during the festival they share the food by leaves to each other. People who were staying in the jungle used this leaves for light by applying the castor oil oil. on the leaves instead of lamp and other lightning instruments we use this tree in roti feast and we dine on the leaves every day this tree is one of the most important to our community and for nature it also helps the livelihood of the community by making honey from the bees the leaves of kaikarilu tree spreads the more fragrance around it from containing of the heavy fragrance the bees used to construct bee hive here from the bees the soliga people can get the honey from it to sell it in the market the tree of kaikarilu which is one of the emotional parts of soliga and also it is helpful for community people to get the money from the honey your report etv bharat to watch 24 into 7 news live download etv bharat app